If you have an isosceles triangle in a circle and you're asked to find the radius, here's what you need to do. Firstly, find the perpendicular height of the triangle. This bisects the base and its right angles to the base, therefore it must go through the center of the circle due to the bisecting chord theorem. Then we can find this little length. Uh, firstly, find the height. That's going to be 12 due to Pythagoras. This length is 5. This little length is going to be 2R take 12. Then we can find the radius using Pythagoras again. This length is going to be R uh, take 2R take 12, which is uh, a negative R plus 12. Then using Pythagoras on this little triangle, R squared is equal to negative R plus 12 squared plus 5 squared. And simplifying for R, this is going to be 169 on 24. What do you think, Ollie? He doesn't care.